and you are even not even mindful and conscious and aware what is happening. So this is the first step. Focus on one thing at a one time, right? Energy management. Think energy. For, sorry. Energy management. Think energy first. Don't split your time, but rather split your energy, right? If you are in contact with someone, then don't think in only in terms of time, but think all think also in terms of energy, because you are giving something, right? So it doesn't mean okay. I, I understand the time is uh, time is the thing, right? But energy is so much important. Right, a lot of people just read this energy energy ratio. They just come in contact with the people who are not even serving them, who are not even helping them, right, to become something great or to achieve something, right. And a lot of people just gossip all the things, and they just spend time in in the leisure activities, right, which which doesn't serve any kind of purpose in their life. So you are wasting the precious amount of energy and time when you do such thing. And so it is damn sure that you will never be successful into your life, right? So know what you what brings you up and know what brings you down, right? What kind of company? What kind of content are you consuming? Who are you supporting, right? That is most important, right? So eliminate all those all those things which is which no longer serve you, whether it's fan, family, right? Any damn thing, right? Because you have limited time and you have limited energy, right? As you wake up, your energy is high, and when you just when when it is a night time, the energy decreases. Some same as like that of sun. So make sure in the 24 hours you know where you are spending your time and energy. Some facts. 82 percent of businesses feel that they are not performing at ideal energy levels. We we when we feel too energetic, we eventually burn out, right? So 82 percent businesses feel that they are not performing at ideal energy levels, right? Energy levels which are too low or too high are not ideal. Strike a balance. You have you have to have momentum and moments of relaxation and slowing down. So now, if I if I have a goal and I'm just working continuously towards it, right? So at one point of time, I will be just drained out of energy. And in the beginning, I'm having energy. So it's kind of you you need to manage. You need to strike a balance. So it's it's you you also need to have a spare time. Have the ideal time, have the free time for yourself. Not only working over every day, 24 and 7, you're just working, working, working. You even sometimes forget to relax, to give the time to yourself, to your friends and family. And it is so much crucial and so much important, right? So momentum is important and the moments of relaxation and slowing down is also important. So that's why in this red dress, sometimes I just feel that slowing Slow life is so much important. Everyone is in the red race. They just want this, that, this, that so fast. Running everywhere here and then, right? But they forgot many things, very important things in their life. And so that's why I just feel the slow life is also very much important. It, it's kind of refueling for you also, right? So how to refuel and recharge? Schedule refuel and recharge time. Example, weekly meditation classes, exercise. Meditation is so much important. I told you about mindfulness, right? In the first step. So it's kind of meditation only, right? You can do any time meditation. Meditation can be done anytime when you focus 100% on that work. You are actually out of meditate because you are making your brain capable to do that one thing at one time. So it's kind of discipline also. And many other things are getting involved, right? You don't understand the importance, but it is really important. Double the time you think you need to refuel a tip. Yeah, gravity towards positive people where they are, yes. So those people who just support you in your dreams, right? Those those makes your vibe high, right? Make sure you spend that time with them also. So this kind of refueling. For example, if you are working at certain project and you are failing them, or you are not getting any kind of results, but some positive people comes up and he and they show some new idea or talk something which will help you to elevate that bad mood so it's kind of that thing right write down what may happen if you don't refuel how it will affect the different aspects of your life yes it affects it affects a lot of things when you don't refuel you are draining your energy you are you are even not knowing your goal and you you just spend the things in in the wrong direction not knowing the right path when you don't refuel when you don't sit down with yourself when you don't analyze what you are going through, right? What in whatever goal you are accomplishing. So it is so much important to refuel, right? 
So we are not machinery, but inside there is a machine. We are not machinery, but inside there is, understand this, this is so important and crucial, right? We are not machinery, but we, but inside there is a machine. So you need to understand this thing, right? Managing negative energy. This is so important. When a turtle is happy in its environment, it extends its limbs out of its shell as far as possible to soak up as much as light as possible. When it's under attack, it retracts its limbs in its shell to protect itself, be that turtle. So this is the best example. When you are seeing your energy vampires, the people who are draining out your energy, be like that turtle. Be adaptable to the environment. And you extend your limbs when you feel good. And when you feel that every everything good is coming to me, you just absorb that. And when it is under attack, means surrounded by energy vampires and negative people, right? The people who who doesn't serve you, right? So it is you are into an attack. So preserve your energy in that. That that is so important. So imagine this is the uh, this is a very well known example, but I but I will definitely tell you because it will give a great information. So if you had eight thousand eighty six thousand four hundred and someone stole four thousand dollars from you, would you spend your time and energy directing your focus it on how it was stolen? And who stole it when you still have $86,000? Same goes for 86,400 86, seconds that are gifted to you every day. So stop dwelling right, on the negative. right? And if someone stole you that amount of energy or they wasted this kind of time, right? you just don't focus on that. right? And focus what is positive and what is bringing you up. That is a message. So negative energy can always swap, swap your energy, right? It's like when you just go into some room and you don't feel comfortable around certain people. But there are some people who just come enter the room and it lighten up your environment and you will feel so much amazing. So that is the power of energy, your aura, your vibration, your frequency. What is some of the friends or family members give out negative energy? It's okay to help grow people which are not, who are not growing, right? Uh, those who change their progressive journey and last are those are those who change their circle of the people around them. So circle is so much important. Right? For family members, spend time with them, but preserve your energy. Right? Exclusive focus. To exclusive focus on a task or a project is to pay full attention it. So this is the exclusive focus part. I already told regarding this mindfulness. So it's kind of supportive. So for, for these all those people, you you just eliminate this kind of people who are just an energy vampire and who don't serve you anything. It is so much crucial and important when it comes to success. You see almost all the successful people have 24 hours and they spend their time very much wisely. They spend their time and energy very wisely. They eliminate all kind of distractions. You are surrounded by a lot of rubbish information and a lot of the things which doesn't even help you. And so now you are bombarded with all this content. And what do you do? You start scrolling. You are scrolling the social media, right? To consume all this service content. And you are now investing your time and energy, right? It's, it's depleting your energy levels. So it is so much important. Exclusive focus, I already told you that you, right now the attention and focus is so much important, right? When you are focusing on these lectures, high lectures of, important lectures of 10 to 15 minutes, then you are you are also developing that focus, one point focus, doing one thing at a time is so much important. So exclusive focus is very much important when you want to successful, when you want to become successful and when you want to achieve something in your life. So this these we already know the brain has two sides, the right, the left hand side and the right hand side. The left hand side is known as the conscious mind. It is Regarding the logistic mind, so it is stable, statistics, logic, six, level headed. And the right hand side is the creative mind, the subconscious mind. It is used for exploration, it is used for creativity, it's for dynamics. So, switching from one task to another at one time is like switching on one side of the brain and switching off the other. It's like running from city to the countryside and back again. Understand this, right? You are multitasking, you are switching tasks from one thing to another. So you in in that way you are damaging this thing. You you are not progressing any any kind of stuff, right? So 
make sure you do one thing at a time there is there is a book called by gary keller one thing it tells you how multitasking is is damaging you right so this is most important right make sure you just take a lot of it right and if you are enjoying the content till now then make sure you like and subscribe it so your brain can't process two things at one time at productive levels if you have too many apps open in the phone everything slows down the same thing happens in our brain so this is quite a quite a simple thing but a lot of people don't understand this right so brain can't process each and every information same goes with the shorts and reels you are just expecting in 60 seconds everything is being explained but it is not possible right you are actually triggering the dopamine and now the brain is a lot of varieties has experienced a lot of varieties so you will not find any kind of ex- excitement in this kind of lecture you will definitely find a boring right but this is the most important thing and it is okay to feel boring right so make sure you you know this thing right do one thing with full attention at one time it's a kind of mindfulness meditation recognizing the race you need to run we are so used to having so much instant thing in our lives now that we forget that it's a marathon it's not a sprint we spend so much time harping on this that we swap our energy unnecessarily this is the important this is the gist right so that's why just slow down the rate rest right don't expect so many things so much fast like zomato and swiggy delivery right i am also i started this content not at i i know that it's a marathon right i need to run a long race it's not like i am making this content and now i will be having so many people supporting and all this thing i never i never thought of it of it actually my goal is to help people right this is this is why this is why i created this channel right so it's not about money fame success it will come right it's a secondary part but i am thinking about something which is long run right it's not just one or two content i'm publishing and now i'm expecting the results same goes with this thing right so success cannot be delivered at your doorstep it cannot be pre ordered you need to walk away as far as possible from your own door to open up more doors to open up more opportunities this is the thing like room was not built in a day and you can't expect success to come to you right in just one step it takes it is a long journey right so this also this is the important thing patience for big thing and impatience for the small things big things like being writing a book working on project etc small things like being write, writing an article going in all you not as not the same as exclusive focus so if i am having a big goal it is important for me to have a patience as compared to the small goal like writing an article right so if i might be impatient right when it comes to so doing small things but when it is high, when it is something which is bigger i need to be patient this is the thing so don't try to be a professional pretzel to force yourself into a mold that you can't clearly fit in don't try to be somebody you are not you can bend and adapt or try new things but don't for yourself to be someone who you are not don't get distracted by by what others want you to be yes because a lot of people don't just think what they want they listen what other people is expecting of themselves but you must know thyself that is important when you do you know thyself you know what you are capable and what you can do with what you are currently having right so this is so much important strike a balance between stepping out of your comfort zone and staying true to who you are right it's a balance it's always a balance between professional and personal life right your pace everyone is a different at levels of energy everyone lives on different energy levels they express their energy levels in different ways yes some people express energy by just sharing the story or just speaking another can do by writing an article so everyone has their different form of energy and they can just channel their energy and transfer that form from one form to another right so for me when i am on to some one to one call or this my energy level is with full focus 
attention awareness deep thought deep compassion deep meditation and prayer for or with other person right and i am on the stage then my energy level is always hype like a who so people always connect with the person who is having high in energy so always check your energy levels are you being drained with someone are you having low energy levels are you having low vibes check on yourself it is so much important so recognize what energy means for you everyone has their own pace for example morgan freeman became an actor when he was 52 So when you are into date race, you think that okay at the age of this I want to become this right. But sometimes it is not possible right. Maybe universe doesn't want you or universe has some other plan for you right. So everyone has his own pace. Trust the universe. Trust the process, and in that way you can achieve anything. So what is your pace means? Don't strive for perfection. Strive for progression. you you need to be growing on daily basis trust your body listen to what is telling you refuel and recharge if you need to do and then go out and give your energy productively find your flow the highest level of brain energy where the skill meets challenge for example j skills are shared wisdom and challenge to reach out to so many people where he finds the meeting point between these two he is in flow and he is in element So, in flow means what you say, what you do are in are in complement to each other, complementing each other, are in accordance with each other. That is what is the flow, right? So, if I am saying that I want to help people and my content is something different, then I am not in a flow, right? So that is the thing. So, main takeaway. What is the main takeaway? Let me just let me just okay. Okay, so for in order to you to spread energy, you need to know what you want to spend energy on. To do this, to do this, you need to know who truly you are. What are your core values? What do you stand for? What do you want to be? What do you love? So this is the gist. I want you to just mark all this and just take a note of what is important. Right? I hope that this video will definitely help, and I am able to provide some kind of. help right or some kind of value into your life right if you think so then make sure to like share and subscribe right? see you in the next video till then bye